project. Save the project. What was happening? What did your vision tell well, you was happening? That there was movies that needed a deacon in it to just bring the spiritual awareness mm -hmm. that was needed. And so I did. I walked over the desert. 500 miles. 500 miles? 500 miles. That is bad, but it's not a drop of water in sight. Didn't even have a cloud in the sky. But I knew I had one one objective in mind, and that was to get to the Tony Winters project. And I say it because the word had come down that I had to leave it. Well, in the process, I stopped and I became a teacher. I taught in L.A. District, and I taught in Connecticut, mm -hmm. and I said I had to give that up because I still had the Tony Winters and Project in mind. Wow, this is some kind of a journey that you've hey, been through. You don't know how many, it's been over 200 years. 200 years. Now wait a minute. If I'm if I'm Tony's auntie, <laughs> you trying to say I'm older than 200 years? No, 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 no. no. But see, I knew. Oh, your journey. Okay. This is before to Tony's before time, Tony my time. time. Okay. Was, I knew that this was going to be. Okay. Well, okay. Just as long as we got that part yes. straight, you can continue. Yes. And then I went into acting. Uh huh. And I have. I did a pilot with our senior home. Uh huh. I. Did some Port Charles. Mm -hmm. I, uh, you mean the soap opera Port soap Charles? Opera. Oh my. Uh, what role did you play in Port I Charles? I was the recurring uh, elevator operator. I mean, repairman. Uh huh. Yeah. Well, that's an important job, you know. Yeah, I mean, well, the elevator didn't break anymore, so they haven't recurred. <laughs> But that gave you some, you know, really good experience. And I have some commercials right? running. Uh-huh. Um, and I just finished doing fences over at Theater Floyd. Uh-huh. I played Gabriel. Um, That's, you've got a very, uh, very so I'm a little, rich so, background so in acting. So I'm here uh -huh. to save the Tony Winters project. I see. So I'm here. And what is your role in the movie? In this movie? Uh-huh. The one that, the, the one that... I told you that happened when I got this bolt of lightning 200 years ago. Deacon Fryer. Deacon Fryer. Deacon, Fryer. yes, God came to me 200 years ago. Jeez. Yes, and said, I want you to go forth and play in this, and be in this movie that Tony Winters uh -huh. produced. Yeah. And he said, of course, he has not been born yet, but he will be by the time you reach destination. I'm telling you, I'm focusing in those eyes because those eyes must be plenty tough to look out 200 years ahead of the game. Yes. Wow. And, and don't wear glasses. <laughs> and there are no drugs on the set. <laughs> no, 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 no drugs. <laughs> that was the young lady that carried me through the desert. <laughs> oh my goodness. She doesn't look like she's old enough to do it all 200 years. <laughs> That is it. I see. Well, tell me, Bob, yeah. how did you happen to find out about this film? Oh, now, this is the truth. I, uh, uh, Carl and I go to the same barbershop, uh -huh. uh, where I was in the same barbershop. And he was, ta uh, he was talking about the project. And I said, oh, gee, I wouldn't mind getting in that. So he said, well, that maybe you can park in this place. So that's how it's going. Oh, my goodness. That's Carl is very popular around here. Everybody's kind of referred here by Carl. Uh, <laughs> Carl's kind of referred a lot of people yeah, to this project. Yeah, 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 He's yeah. done an excellent job of getting the right yeah, people here because yeah. you all have seen you in action, and yeah. I know you're going to really uh, wow the audiences. Thank you very much. Yes. Sir. Thank you very much. Yeah. Um, in closing, uh, are there any special thoughts or words uh, you'd like to share? Tell I wish this project the best, and I think it will be. And at the rate that it is going, I think it has a possibility of being nominated for an award. Wonderful, yeah. wonderful. There's a lovely cast, a lovely crew. Uh-huh. Yeah. Okay. Well, I'm sure he's going to appreciate those very kind words. Oh, and Bob, I really appreciate you taking the time to talk with us. I know it was nice of you to ask me. I really appreciate it. <laughs> okay, then. Okay. Take it easy, nah, but you remember know. to take it. Ah, okay. And keep on that walk, okay? Oh, shit. Thanks. I have <laughs> project that I'm working on. Oh.
you <laughs> okay. okay, thank you. Bye-bye. Bye -bye. Oh. Hi, how are you doing, Judy? Doing great. And for our worldwide audience who's going to see this show one day, <laughs> who are you? My name is Greta Fischita. Greta, I really enjoyed your performance today. Well, thank you so yeah. much. You wanna, I enjoyed it myself. So what role have you been playing? I've been playing the part of Verlene. Oh, Verlene. Mother. Okay. And um, I feel especially honored that Tony asked me to do this part. Okay, how long have you known Tony? Yeah, I've known him for a very long time when um, the um, CAG was a training um, organization for young actors, and uh -huh. I met Tony there, and we did some classes together, and we've been friends ever since, for several years. Wonderful, wonderful. I know when he greeted you today, it was like a long lost friend, and <laughs> yeah. you are very special to him. Thank you. Okay, how did, um, I mean, at what time did you hear about this role, that he was writing a play? You know, he just told me, he called me one day and said that he was writing a, a play, and he had a part, the part of his mother, that he would like for me to read for it. Uh huh. We did um, a reading for some producers to video heads. Uh huh. I guess and then the rest is going to be history. <laughs> 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 Have you done other roles before? Mm -hmm. mm, I do quite a bit of commercials. Uh -huh. I really like to do that, although I, I want to do more. I've done a couple of other films as well. Mm -hmm. Charlie Burnett, but um, I've enjoyed doing this with Tony very much. Yeah, well, I know you're going to be a real smash hit with, oh, with the audience. I was wondering um, what you were doing with this camera. <laughs> <laughs> well, <clears throat> it's been a wonderful cast room, and you, I count you amongst them. And, and as we wrap up, um, are there any other kind words you'd like to say to Tony or wish him well? Thank you so much, Tony. This has been a real pleasure. It's a wonderful opportunity for me. I really appreciate it. Thank you. Okay. Well, I guess the next time I'll see you will be at the screening. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Well, thank you so much for sharing your thoughts and a continued success in your career as well. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Bye bye now. And who are you? I'm uh, Richard Whiteson. Richard Whiteson, where do I know that name from? Uh, you have an awfully familiar face. I think I'm um, working on this thing called Retiring Tatiana with his nephew, <laughs> Tony Winter. Oh, that's where I've seen you before. Yeah, yeah, okay. Like Johnson. Uh huh. Yeah, yeah. And who is um, Mr. Johnson? Uh, what's his role in this? Okay, Johnson is uh, really sick. He's the out there type of brother. He's out there uh -huh. like to have fun, have a good time. Smooth. At least he thinks he's smooth. Mm-hmm. Uh, well, from what I've seen, you should have a really sore neck because every pretty girl that walks <laughs> by you're supposed to look at. Yeah, well, you know, he's a man. He likes to enjoy, you know, uh -huh. things that men enjoy. Yeah. You know. yeah. <laughs> but I've also seen you do some very challenging parts. Uh, you got a little dance routine, a little singing routine, and <laughs> I'm not going to give the plot away, but, oh, okay. Okay. But, uh, but, but, but you've had some very challenging parts. You've been on, on camera quite a bit, and um, yeah. Uh, from jogging to dancing, uh, and yeah, you know, yeah. so I know that you you really worked hard to make this a movie a very very big success. Oh, thank you very much. Yeah. Thank you very so much. I know this is going to be a success. And what is it going to really be building upon? Like, like I said, I think I've seen you in some commercials on TV. Before. Yeah. Yeah. Just a different stuff. Just around. Uh -huh. <laughs> It was with Eric Estrada, the old um, the guy that did chips. Yeah, chips. You, you, you two were doing a, a film, um, oh, not a film, a, a turkey. Yeah, 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 yeah. It was really cool. I saw oh, it. I appreciate that. It was really cool. I, yeah. I enjoyed it. Yeah. I think I'm gonna go out and get me some of that turkey. Okay. Well, how long have you known Tony? Yeah, I've known Tony since 1994. We met doing. Um, these women were doing a single thing at a hotel. You know, you know what, four guys and four girls putting on different skits that they made up. Uh huh. And, uh, so I met Tony then. Like, uh -huh. I guess it was early 94. Uh huh. And, uh, it was a cool ever since. See, well, I can tell you all work really well on camera together. Oh, cool, thanks. Yes, yeah. indeed. Now, um, I know you've got to go in for a couple more shots. Uh, that, you know, I know we've got another three or four hours before we wrap up. But, um, you know, are there any special words you'd like to say to Tony? Uh, I want to say, Tony, first of all, you're looking out, man. I appreciate you, you know, asking the brother to do this. Mm. It's my pleasure. And I'm proud of you, man, because it takes a lot of heart to actually do this, man. You know, a lot of people talk about it, 
Who mm-hmm. actually did it? You like battle? You like Master Chief? You thought about it? Uh, mm-hmm. You did it. Uh-huh. So, uh, so much success to you, man, and God bless you. And I'm sure it will be a big great success. I'm sure it will too. With your, your talents involved and your 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 wonderful support. Oh, thank and you. I suppose after you finish these things this evening, the next time I'll run into you will be at the Dick Spring in Hollywood. Okay. There you go. Okay. On the East Coast. On the East Coast, yes. I'm gonna have I'll get my host one on the East Coast. <laughs> okay. Okay. Thank you so much for joining us. All right now. Bye bye. Peace out, Tom. All right. All right. <laughs> bye bye. <laughs>